Hey, what's on going on, vlog buddies? Um, as you know, my name's Alan. But um, jeez, tonight's video is actually um, I don't even know anymore. Like, I had an idea, then it gets flew away from me. But just to give you a little heads up, last night I had a great evening, except I was reminiscing. Last night I decided to go clubbing, but not before going to a couple parties. I went to two parties, a going away party. Then I walked to the walk to the city party or whatever. Then I was at this party over at the task force for AIDS, uh, HIV AIDS or whatever. Then I went to this club called Bounce, which is actually part of this, this bar called Union Station. <sighs> all right. The whole night out of all these parties, out of everything that I did, I could not stop thinking about people who I was actually interested in, like. Instant gratification does nothing for me now, so that makes me pretty mad. Cause I, not mad, miffed. Cause I got three out of the four things I didn't have to pay anything for. Everything was pretty much free, but the last club balance I paid ten dollars to get in. But unfortunately, I had to deal with these sorry ass attitudes. Cause um, like I haven't been there in months, so I really don't know what's going on because I wasn't there with my regular friends or whatever. So this asshole of a, not, um, not he was an asshole, this is doing his job, so, he was like, um, where's your ticket at? And I was like, what ticket? So I had to double back around, and this club is like, it's like this big, but when you have to go back around, it's like this big. So I had to go back around and do something, you know, oh, you have, to, you have to buy a ticket to get in. So I thought it was uh, free before 10 o'clock, and I was like, oh, okay, I can do that. But anyway, luckily I had money, and I didn't have to walk away embarrassed, like, like ugh, I hate you people. But, um, yeah. It was cool. It was fun. Like, I saw Carrie Nichols. She was she's a beast. I love her. I love her when she performs. Um, I saw Akasha. I love her. Um, oh, by the way, I saw this one girl. She was dressed like she was going to prom, but it actually it was actually a transgendered um, male, and it looked like Sherry not Sherry but uh, Carrie Nichols' daughter. Like, if, it were, if that were actually possible, like that was it looked like Carrie's daughter, basically. And, um, yeah. So, after I got done clubbing, like, around, like, maybe 12.30, I guess, um, I got up and left. But not before, like, I was talking to this dude named Gabe, and, um, I asked him if I wanted to find him, how would, how would I do that? And he was like, if I Facebook me, so I'm going to Facebook him later. But, yeah. I'm still actually wearing my club outfit because I just came home maybe like at 4 o'clock this morning and then I've been up and down sleep and then my nieces were over and then had to go all the way back across town so I can get my stuff from my sister's house because I spent the night over her place. That's where I got ready to go to the club at. And, um, God, it was just, uh, so, thinking about, I'm trying to remember everything back because, like, I literally forgot the whole night. I can't. I can't. I couldn't tell you right now everything that happened back to back except for where I've been. But I'll remember later on, I'm sure. But um, I got hit on so much. But I'm not looking for a hookup. Well, like yeah. And then I got hit on. I got hit on by this one girl who was actually a guy. And what she didn't know was that she actually dated my brother. And. My rule is, if you date a family member, we can't date at all, because you been, you been, you already mixed the tree, or you've already had you've already had your sip of the yogurt or pudding or whatever, and you know I pretty much can't be because um excuse me I'm hungry yeah yo plate yogurt uh, peach flavor mm. oh, that's good so. She still got my number. I'm pretty sure she might she might have called, but um, uh, I'm just have to explain it to her in person. Cause I'm a gay dude, so that means I like men, which means I like penis and ass, which means I don't want a woman or a guy portraying to be a woman in my relationship. I want a man. Man. And I don't care if you have feminine qualities. I really don't. Like, just recognize that you are a man, I'm a man, and we are a gay couple. That's, a, that's all That's all I want, really. I mean, if you're a masculine, I don't care. We'll be two masculine, gay-ass niggas, but... 
I don't know what to tell you. So, um, yeah. So right now, I'm about to jump in the shower. Wash this under 21 sticker off my hand. And this paw print. Let me see. Yeah, that paw print. Wash that shit off. Make my dinner, which is going to be tuna fish and... Hold on. Ooh. Baked chips. Because for one, I've been on this diet for a month, and I've lost 27 pounds. Because I used to be 305. You do the math, because, like, I don't even know. And then, that's a whole other story of myself. My sister drove to Burger King and asked me, What you want on the dollar menu? I want to stop right up and say, Bitch, please! I'm trying to lose this weight. You trying to encourage me? You are an enabler. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm sorry for the profane night, which is just that I had a really long night, almost little to no sleep, and I literally have to sell this gym to my dad either on Tuesday or Wednesday, so I can keep working out. But for the next three days, I'm off. But that does not mean. I'm going to slack off and go eat whatever the hell I want. I'm still going to be eating healthy. I'm just not going to be working out for the next three days. I mean, my guns are tired and I need a break. Because, I mean, I've been working out six days a week. Sunday being my rest day. I'm benching, not my weight. I'm benching almost half my weight now. I'm benching uh, 135. So I'm pretty sure in another month I'll be benching myself. And then eventually I'll be able to push it more. And then I'll be one of those cocky niggas at the club. With a fine ass body and a fucking six pack, so that's the shit I want. I want, I want to, I want to walk up to you up on the dance floor and be like, I, I'm feeling you. Is you feeling me? Can we take it somewhere else? I want, to, I want to chill. I want to talk to you. That's all I want. But anyway, in the meantime, deuces. I love you, and I appreciate you taking the time to listen. So in the meantime, have a good night. Peace.